In this video, you will see how to use the advanced section of the My Design Snap app. Here is the icon for the My Design Snap. When you open it up, it will connect with the machine. Now, we have the three sections. We're going to come up here to the embroidery section. It says Snap Capture with Frame for Pattern Positioning. So that means you're going to have an embroidery design in the machine and you want to have it for positioning. So we're going to go back to the machine screen to bring up a design to begin with. So on our screen here, we're going to touch the screen to wake up from the screensaver. I'm going to embroidery. I'm going to the memory. I'm going to bring up a treble clef. You select set to bring it into your embroidery screen. And there it is in the middle of the screen to work with. Now, that just moves and you can put it wherever you need to, but that's why we're going to go back to the Snap app for positioning help. We're going to start now here in the embroidery section, Snap Capture with the Frame. So when I touch this, it tells us now to hold the device over the embroidery frame, but it's in the easy mode. When you go to the advanced mode, it tells us that we need to put a snowman positioning sticker on our fabric, and it says in the location of where you want the embroidery to be. So on this hoop here, I have already placed a snowman positioning marker in the center of this white area of this plaid fabric. I did that on purpose, and you can see that the snowman positioning marker is not in the center of the hoop, because the center of the hoop would be about here, because here's my mark here and here, and then left and right. So if we draw a line this way and this way, the center would be somewhere about here. And we have the positioning marker off center down to the right. So now, with the Snap app, and the app has told us now to put the marker on our fabric, which we have done, you touch the word OK, and now you're going to follow the rest of the instructions on the screen. So I'm going to hold this over the hoop with the snowman marker in it, and it will tell us when to hold still. And it does the countdown, 3, 2, 1, and then it tells us it took the picture. So now it tells us send to the machine. So you simply touch those words, send to the machine, and then it tells you that it is sending, and it tells you that it did, in fact, send the background. So you say OK, and it goes back to the opening screen of the Snap app. So I'm going to put the device down, and back at the machine, it tells us the image was sent from the mobile app update. You simply touch the word OK, and it tells you to attach the frame. Well, this is the one we just took the capture of, so I'm going to attach this with the snowman positioning marker on, and that's what you need to do. Please make sure you leave that sticker on the fabric. When I touch OK again, now touch OK for the third time, and it actually moves into place, you will see that the LED pointer is shining down on the snowman sticker. At this point, you need to check the accuracy of the LED pointer, and you want to make sure the LED pointer is shining down on the dot of the large circle of the snowman sticker. If it is not, you then use your positioning arrows, and you will see that you can actually move that LED pointer light. Now, the movement is very, 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 very small increments, and you want to get that LED light to be right on that dot in the center of the large circle. Once you have the LED pointer aligned with the dot in the large circle of the positioning marker, you go back to your screen and you just touch the word OK in the bottom right hand corner. And then you can see on the screen that the treble clef is still up in the center, not in alignment with the sticker. And you kind of think, OK, that was kind of silly, but this is what happens. Choose the word embroidery in the bottom right hand corner. Then come up to the top and choose the word layout. Then choose the snowman positioning icon here on the screen. And when you do, you'll get another message up saying you it's going to revert to the original position. That's OK. It's a safety message. Touch OK. And here's the important screen. Now the sticker is in the middle of the design. This is the treble clef we brought up. So whatever design you bring up, that will be on display for you. And this is here in the middle because this is highlighted. This is the icon telling you that it's going to align with the middle of the design. So that's where the sticker is there. And if that's how we want the treble clef to be, you simply say OK. And it will align that treble clef in the middle of that snowman sticker. 
and it tells you the pattern was moved. You can see it right here. See how it moved now? That the treble clef is in the middle of that white area of our plaid. That's why I chose plaid so you can tell what's going on. A lot of people at this point now reach in underneath the needle and take their sticker off. Please help yourself. You have this icon over here. Just touch this icon and the whole hoop moves forward so you can easily get that sticker out from underneath the needle. Then take it off. Touch that same icon again. It moves right back underneath. And then touch the word OK. And you'll see your treble clef is right in the middle of your pattern where you had it selected. The snowman sticker is still on display because that was there when you took the snap capture or when you took the picture, even though you took it off of your project. That's all right. Your, your embroidery design is positioned in the right place. Now you simply thread the machine, lower your presser foot, you have your green light, and now you embroider and your design is in the right place. Now, if you don't want it aligned in the middle, you could return. And I'm going right back to the word embroidery. Go right back to the word layout, and we have the snowman positioning icon. Remember, we were here once before. Now, if you didn't want it aligned with the middle, say you wanted it aligned with the bottom, then you would touch here. See how the sticker moves in the display? If I would touch that and say OK, then it's going to move. Now you can see, now the design is aligned with the bottom. The bottom of the design is aligned with that sticker. Okay, see how that works? I could say OK, and now that's where it would be. Or go right back to the snowman positioning icon and say you want to move it to the side. You can do that and say OK. And now it will touch it and it will move it to the side of the sticker. So wherever you want to go. But we did it with the middle, so we're going to leave it back in the middle. Say OK. Say OK because the sticker is already off. And like I said, have threading machine and push go and it will embroider out.